What's up, tankers? Welcome back to Tankers Club. In this video, I'm going to show you uh, my uh, top three tanks in the auction right now and still available to buy and why you should go for them. Of course, a lot of good tanks are already gone, like the Dracula and like the P50 and uh, like the Chieftain MK60, the 210 premium tank. But we have, we still have good tanks in the auction. And uh, if you have some gold and thinking about buying this tank, uh, don't buy anyone. Go for my uh, top three tanks, and I know what I'm talking about. I'm playing a lot of battles with those tanks, and I know just know that that they are great. So my favorite tank, my uh, tank top tank number one is the Object 252U, the bounce machine. This tank we have uh, great armor, we have uh, also good penetration, um, also good speed for a heavy tank, so we can play this tank like a medium, you can rush medium side and make a lot of damage, and uh, the enemy tanks will have huge problems to penetrate you, especially if you go if you go uh, medium and light side, because they don't have powerful gun, and yeah, this tank is just great, I played a lot of battle with this tank and helped me a lot to raise my win rate and to go to the uh, also rating battles and I'm now already at gold league that helped me really really a lot uh, my uh, top tank number two will be the Kampfpanzer 70 um, this tank is also great I played with it a lot of battles and we have a lot of HP which allows you also to rush on enemy tanks take some shots and with that we have that powerful gun with that um, also very good penetration we can reach with hit shells to 341 uh, penetration but we don't need hit shells uh, uh, only playing with gun drama and if you have sometimes a heavy tank with good armored tank uh, before you you can use just hit shells and you will penetrate him no problem uh, the front side of the turret is nearly impenetrable of this tank so try to hide your 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 hull your front hull or front armor especially the down plate behind hills and try to show only your turrets but the side of the turret and the, the side especially are very easy to penetrate that's why i advise you just try to show your turrets and try uh, to face the enemy with your front turret so uh, the most stuff of the shots will bounce yeah it's a great tank as i said we have also with this tank a good mobility for a heavy tank 33 km per hour average speed is just insane and my favorite tank my top tank number three in the auction right now um, is the Lycan. The Lycan is also a great tank. Um, I played with this tank a lot of battles and uh, you can also with this tank rise your win rate. As this tank is not very good, that's why only top, uh, top 3 tank because this tank is not very good for rating battles because if you play rating battles you will always be uh, playing against tier 8 tanks and that's not fair and um, you are not going to um, climb uh, to, to, to better leagues uh, playing with the like and, and rating battles but if you play for example against tier 6 tank or tier 8 tanks in normal battle you will have a great chance also to win and win a lot and a lot of battles and also to bounce a lot of shots because this tank is also perfect well armored nearly 300 millimeter armor and this tank is just beginner friendly and that's why uh, also why i'm choosing those tanks because all of them uh, the object 250 u the camp panzer 70 and the lycan are beginner friendly thanks to that good armor and thanks to that powerful gun so uh, these tanks allows you to make mistakes and uh, also still um, don't uh, get a lot of damage thanks to that just amazing armor and this tank again we have good speed for a heavy tank and um, also great and powerful gun um, you can penetrate uh, the most of the tanks with this tank if you use a PCH shots to 231 uh, millimeter um, just great for a tier 7 tank now let's go to the battlefield and uh, try those tanks let's start with the number one the object 250u let's go the object 252U, the Russian guy, the bad boy, the mother washer, motherfucker Russian guy. I just love this tank. It's my favorite. It's my in the auction number one tank, number one, and also my favorite uh, tier A tank in the game ever. And maybe I would say the the best tank for me right now in the game. This tank is just OP. Um, as I was, I played some some battles. And roll with the tank and I saw how my win rate was raising my win rate from I don't know 0.2% 0.3% in some battles is raising but I can't play because I'm streaming I can't play Apollos with this tank because because it's going to be boring but look at that how much shots are, are bouncing so if, if you are this tank, this tank is beginner is, is beginner friendly so if you don't even know how to angle the shots gotta bounce and you can make um, 
the mistakes and no problem and you can finish things but if you are a skilled player and know how to angle so you are really nearly unpenetrable and you are going to make a huge problem you're going to, to win a lot of battles you, can't, you are going to raise your win rate look at that look at that bounce 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 and you can also go for waiting battles with this thing this thing is just insane so if you are a win rate addict you are going to have a lot of fun with this thing so the object 252 u is my favorite tank in the game and they uh, go for it guys um was also my favorite tank in the auction go for it tankers and uh, yeah there is nothing else to to add it's the best tier 8 premium heavy tank right now my top two tank the second favorite tank in the auction and yeah i usually go with this tank directly to a medium or light side if i play with this tank because it's a heavy tank with great very good mobility and uh, but for that long grid grid of time and not the best armor um yeah this tank is good for pushing we have a lot of um hp but as i said I, I didn't advise you to go with this tank to heavy side because it's not the best armor sorry for that this tank has a great gun if you use heat shells great penetration for that good mobility and if you know how to use this tank for example the turret is nearly unpenetrable but from the front from the side it's easy to penetrate um, as you can see i'm showing right now on only my turret and uh, they can't penetrate me. but here look at this the side from the turret is easy to penetrate because it's flat but the rounded from from the front side make this uh, turret from the front side nearly unpenetrable and i'm using this right now especially i have low hp and with that i'm helping my team just uh, that i push the medium tanks so that the rest of my team the other four can uh, yeah finish in peace um the the, the heavy um enemies tanks uh, we won this battle i'm not going to share with you all the, the battle because it's just about my favorite tanks in the auction but here i show you how uh, the mobility of this tank can use it to your plus and can win the battle so uh, uh, the strength of this tank is that we have a good mobility we can chase um, mediums and light tanks with that speed uh, for a heavy tank it's a good speed and with that you can push um, uh, the enemy tanks and especially the mediums because uh, as i said because of the armor i would uh, not advise you to go heavy side because they will finish you very fast uh, try to show only your turret but it's a great tank because you can make with this tank a lot of damage up to 500 to 600 damage and uh, we have great penetration as you can see and last but least the Lycan. The Lycan is also uh, my favorite tank or my, my one of my favorite tanks in the auction and is my top 3 tank in the auction right now. Of course after that uh, the Dracula and the other tanks are gone. Um, the Lycan is a great tank. Why? Um, we have just unpenetrable armor if you angle well. You have to know how to angle with this tank. For that we have a powerful gun, very good mobility for a heavy tank again. And why the Lycan is actually on top 3 for me, only because you can't play with this tank great rating battles, because you, you will be always uh, playing against tier 8 tanks, that's why I chose the Lycan in the top 3 in the auction now. But if, if the Lycan was a tier 8 tank, I would say, I, I would um, maybe, he, he would get the, the, the rating uh, um, top, my, my, my best tank with the bounce with the bounce machine the object 250 cu and look at this <coughs> with the lycan if you angle well you don't have to angle with this tank you don't have even to fear the smasher later also uh, i'm going to bounce one shot from the su look at this perfect angling and uh, no one can penetrate we have here about 300 millimeter armor so this tank is just insane and you should go for it in the auction if you have enough gold for that go for this tank don't go for the t28 defender in my opinion as i said um sorry but is not um yeah the best tank right now in the auction um lycan is great looks cool um looks like i don't know a batman vehicle uh, I, I love this design this black design but as you can see it's not only looking cool but it's also a great tank and look at this now i'm going to bounce a shot from the su 152 and it's working great uh, powerful gun as you can see look at this 1500 damage blocked 
in the end, I'm going to finish the SU. I don't want to make this video so long, but just to have an idea what the great battles you can win with this tank. This tank is really great for, for if you want to get a better win rate because um, this tank is just beginner friendly. And if you are a skill, skilled player and you know how to angle with this tank, you're going to bounce a lot and a lot of shots, which allow you to uh, win a lot of battles and, of course, raise your win rate. So, Lycan, top three tank in the auction right now. Um, uh, but as I said, of course, if uh, the, the most of the best tank are gone, the Chieftain is gone already, the M60 is gone already, the M60, uh, the Kampfpanzer 70, we talked about it, it's top 2 tank for me, the Object is top 1 for me, the Cannon Expanser, not the best, the Ace 5, not even um, anyone bought this tank, not a lot of people bought this tank, the Defender, MK1 is also great, but it's gone, the T28 Defender, not my favorite, the T25 Pilot 1, if you are an aggressive player and you know how to handle with medium tanks, also great tank but this tank is just not beginner friendly and that's why uh, the Dracula also very very great but for that again you have to be a skilled player for that it's not beginner friendly but Helsing also great tank but they are all gone already right now my favorite tank as I said top three tank is the Lycan then the uh, Kampfpanzer 70 and the best tank right now in the auction is the Object 252U yeah, so go for the tank tankers, uh, buy them if you have enough gold, you will not regret it. And don't buy the other tanks, they are, they are just not worth it. Um, I hope I helped you with this video and um, with the sharing also my opinion. As a skilled player, as an experienced player, I have in this account already 11,000 11, battles and my second account more than uh, also 10,000 battles so I, I, I know what I'm talking about and that's why I'm trying to help also the community and especially the newbies and uh, the beginner players do not have problems in the game and not to be frustrated especially against the yeah, skilled players so thank you all for watching and see you in the next video tankers don't miss the giveaway Friday 24th of December at, uh, at 18 hour 6 p.m. European time be there so you will have a chance to uh, yeah win my second account with all these tanks so see you there bye bye tankers